So now let's see how we can work around with the selection options inside of Microsoft Paint. So if I were to go around over here on to brush and then draw out something, I got a bit of content to work with. So let me just go around into color one and select this. The color two, I'm just going to keep it white. That is the background color. And maybe I want to have a few more colors right here. So if I were to go around into selection tool, you can see that by default, you have the square selection. So I can select this out and bring this anywhere I want. So it's as simple as click and dragging it. And then what you can do is you can resize it. You can place it in it or wherever you want. Click outside and there you go. That is what selection tool is used for. So what I can also do is I can select this around right here and under selection, there's free form tool. So you can go around and do like free form selection according to what you want. Click and drag this out as well. So you got the selection tool right here. You also have different options like you can select all right here and move it around just like this. Click outside and it, it gets converted into pixels. So you can go around over here and what you can also do is select. And if you want to do an invert selection, you can go on to selection, click on invert selection. So the outside is selected. So if I were to go around into select, let's say, for example, select this out right here and delete it. You can see that you can delete out the folder as well. So you got different options right here on the selection part. So you can select it around and work it in the way you want. So that is how you can work around with selection tool uh, inside of Microsoft Paint. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.